ERC, quality service since 1972. Repairing TVs, console stereos, electronic musical instruments, pinball machines, arcade games, and more. Call 836-0454. This is James Spann, and this is the Halloween edition of the Weather Extreme video. This is for Friday morning, the 31st day of October. And hey, this forecast pretty simple. No uh, tricks. We've got all treats for today and over the weekend. Let's go to some Skycam shots around the network this morning. First off, the view coming from Birmingham, looking south in the top of the Daniel Building. Uh, generally speaking, not as cold this morning. Most spots are in the upper 30s, but a few of the colder valleys are around freezing. Here's a look at downtown Clanton coming from the Skycam down in Chilton County and up in Walker County. A nice look at downtown Jasper on a clear, rather chilly, late October morning. Well, the big trough is gone, the one that brought the cold air. We've got a little Vortmax coming down around Kansas City, but uh, that will be encountering very dry air, so no uh, real impact. And, of course, all of the action is out west. A major trough moving into uh, California, Oregon, Washington, heavy rain and mountain snow out there. We'll peek at the uh, temperatures, and uh, it's cold again this morning. You see 30s all the way down into uh, eastern Mississippi and central Alabama, 20s in New England. But we'll see that slow moderating trend continuing over the weekend. And once again, a familiar looking map there. That's the QPF chart, the expected rain across the country through uh, the middle of next week. And that shows nothing here. All of the heavy rain out in the northwest. Also some rain on the South Atlantic coast. And just for the fun of it, I thought we'd peek at the tropics. Uh, you know, we've got one more month left in the hurricane season, but uh, things are quiet. That disturbance out there in the middle Atlantic will not have much of a chance to develop because of hostile upper air winds. Here's the GFS. This is the OZ run, valid at 1 o'clock today. And you can see how heights are coming up, so temperatures will rebound. Uh, dry air means a sunny day with temperatures around 70 today. Tomorrow, low 70s likely after a start around 40. Bright, sunny day. And pretty much the same deal on Sunday. Uh, the closest rain down over the Florida Peninsula where uh, Atlantic moisture is feeding in. Monday of next week, we stay dry. We'll go to Tuesday, flip it back to the upper levels. You can see a new trough out west. Uh, Wednesday, that begins to deepen across the Plain States, and we stay dry through Wednesday. Here's Thursday. Uh, the trough deepens over the middle of the nation. We'll go down beneath that. The surface front is still to the west from Chicago down to about Shreveport. And then on Friday, a week from today, the 7th of November, uh, the trough is uh, digging down through the southeastern states, and this shows the rain moving out. Uh, so this run really hints at the best chance of rain from uh, Thursday night into Friday morning of next week. And uh, again, there could be some thunder. This run is a little stronger and deeper with the system. And then on the following Saturday, the 8th of November, a week from tomorrow, it looks dry and uh, colder. Uh, but, a, but a nice day there. We'll go out five more days, the 13th of November. Here comes the next trough. And uh, that one looks pretty dynamic. And that one looks potentially wet and stormy with a surface low near Chicago. And what a whopper of a snowstorm that would be for Minneapolis, St. Paul, and Des Moines, if that's right. But we all know this could change. And a couple of days later, the system is gone. That looks uh, dry and cold out there at mid-month on November 15th. Boy, we're getting close to Thanksgiving, aren't we? Time is flying. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this morning. We'll have notes on the blog, the next video here by 3.30 or so today. And, of course, we invite you to watch us on television this evening, ABC 3340 News at 5, 6, and 10. Again, thanks for watching. Have a wonderful day, and God bless. Weather, 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 weather.